Welcome back everyone, it's Abdali here with another exciting episode of Xenoblade Chronicles 2 for Nintendo Switch. We're continuing on with the exploration of this uh, warship, and uh, hopefully we can find our way out. So thank you guys so much for coming back. Man, a lot has kind of happened off screen. We got little Poppy doing a dance as usual, but uh, we stopped right over here because we found this green control module. We clicked it on, and then of course there's also a pathway control that, that this is going to lower the drawbridge down so it allows us to go over this way without going the circuitous way around. So I'm hoping that that means that we can open this with a red, uh, yeah, I don't think so, maybe not. Here, hangar division console. Okay, well, I guess that opened it for us. Let's see what's going on, okay. Here we go. Ah, not much further to exit. Not so fast, my dear intruders! Letting a terrorist from Torna out of my grasp would make me look very bad indeed. Oh, that emerald core crystal! You must be the Aegis! Much as it pains me to admit it, it seems Morad was right on the money. You know who Power is? Are you trying to capture her too, you ratbag? No, <laughs> no, language! But of course, the most powerful blade in all of history, with the power to rend all rest asunder. Only a fool would know of that power and not seek to claim it. And I am no fool. Therefore, I will claim her as my own. You cannot argue with such logic. Flaw detected in final step of logic. Uh. Sorry. <laughs> But you've done all the capturing you're gonna do today. Such impertinence for a dirty terrorist! Let's go! Pyro! Got it! Alright, so boss battle. That's pretty exciting to start the episode off, right? Holy moly. Alright, here we go. Uh, we got Dougal. Uh, now we've got ourselves a decent sized party. It's uh, worth knowing to learn how to deal with aggro. I dare say you've already noticed, but while a driver is being attacked by an enemy, they'll be marked with a red ring. We call this the aggro marker. The wedges on the marker point to the target, or uh, targeting enemies showing the direction you're being attacked from. Aggro is a measure of an enemy's aggression towards the drivers they're fighting. The more viciously you attack an enemy, the more it'll want to attack you back. Drawing aggro is dangerous for healers, since they have low HP. They're more likely to be incapacitated by attacks. Make sure to keep uh, Nia's aggro low. Drivers ha that have defense-oriented classes are better equipped to draw aggro and absorb enemies' attacks, so right now it's better for Tora to have the most aggro. Drivers of the fighter type class are the ones that focus on dealing damage. That's Rex, so make him the mainstay of your offense. Here's a cheat sheet. Defenders take the hit, healers heal defenders, fighters hurt the enemy. <laughs> well, now you know about aggro. Uh, that's two things to keep in mind uh, while you're giving uh, Dougal what for. But see, like, they don't tell you like how to not draw the aggro. And they're just talking about, oh yeah, just general concepts. Like, okay, well, what's the deal? Come here. All right, so I'm getting, uh, yeah, I want to take care of this guy first. I guess I should go over there then. Get this guy. He's got a little shotgun and whatnot. I should be positioned to the side or behind him. Actually, we don't need that just yet. I don't think I should use that. There we go. Get that big 852. Do you see that huge damage? Oh, no. I did this wrong. Where did he go? Oh, he's over here. So, I mean, I could use my level 1, and everyone else is asking for the level 1. That coward. He's just hiding behind his blade. What? Does common sense elude you? A blade can regenerate from any injury. Whereas if I die, my blade will return to a useless core. So it's okay to use them as a living shield? You weasel! Even if they can regenerate, that doesn't mean blades don't feel pain. <laughs> How cute! The Fleabag thinks we should care about blade feeling! 
<laughs> I wonder if you can feel pain. Get back here. So this is a battle that starts all over again? One, two, oh, I didn't even get that boost. Oh my gosh, what the heck? Alright, he's at half health. Maybe we should start using some of our uh, arts. Or like our super specials. Oh my gosh, this blowdown is insane! Wow, wow! There we go, got that big hit! Nice, a thousand damage on him, sweet! Wake up, I got a little bit more for the combo, let's go! What is he, invin invincible? How is he invincible? Oh, come on! Right when I was about to use my art, it totally cancelled me out. Eighteen fifty two, did you see that? <laughs> uh, doing that backslash is pretty awesome. Of course it's not a backslash, but a mingy flea bug and a bunch of stinking kids. I triumphant return to more Arden with the Aegis. Oh. Out like a light. That's what he gets for trying to execute Nia. What? He was trying to take me back to Morardane. Rex, this is a trap. A trap? So they weren't actually going to execute you? No time! Talk later, Rex Rex. We should escape! Master Pawn is right. Chance of reinforcements very high. Let us make haste. Getting out of town would be a good start. Do I get to pick up all the stuff on the ground first? Dude, did you see how much junk fell out of him? Please tell me that's all in my inventory now. Ah, it's frustrating. Wow! World has many amazing places in it! Perhaps rest and enjoy view for a bit. I wonder if there's anything to explore in this area. Again. It's her. And with a driver too this time. That's Morag, the flame bringer. Morag? 
Special Inquisitor Morag of Morar Day, the most powerful driver in the Empire, and wielder of bridges, the most powerful blade. So together they're like ultra powerful. <laughs> it looks like they were waiting for us. Yes, indeed. I did feel like we got away a little too easily. I don't know why I expected Diggle to slow you down at all. It was you, right? You're the one who spread the rumor that I was going to be executed. Just to lure Rex and the others here. You catch on quickly. Yes. You certainly proved useful. However... Rex and Pyra are the real price. <laughs> Not quite. The Emerald Core Crystal is the sign of the Aegis. If that blade is indeed the Aegis, then there's something I must do. What do you mean? The power to sunder all rest itself. I cannot allow that to happen again. Hyra destroyed the world. Don't be so stupid. You mean you didn't know? 500 years ago, during the Aegis War, the Aegis sank three continents to the Cloud Sea's bed. Three titans destroyed. I speak not but historical fact. I'm on to you. You want to use Pyra as some kind of weapon? We're not gonna let you do that. That is precisely the kind of scenario that I mean to prevent. And what if we resist? Then I will have to restrain you by force. In that case, I'll make this nice and clear. You will never take her! Then let's see if you have the strength to back up those words, boy. <clears throat> okay, here we go. Wow, you're just doing work. Oh my gosh, he's just doing so much work. Seven fifty, not bad. Oh, she's not too bad. Oh my, is this guy down? Oh, what is he doing? Oh, I was gonna say. Boom, 1339, love it. Oh, she got really upset with that one. It's easy, are you kidding? <laughs> well, it's just a, it's a little bit of a battle here. All right, if you guys aren't gonna go pick those potions up, I will. All right, got a little bit of knockback, not back, not bad, here we go. Two. Here we go. Oh, come on. I guess I'll go for level two backslash. Her attacks seem pretty cool. Oh, I missed that. Sorry. 
totally was paying attention to other things. Boom! 1909! Woo! 1-2! Okay, that's not bad. Nice. <laughs> that was great. Look at all that money we made, too. Just not. Okay, you know what? At least we got the money on the previous dude, probably. What? child why don't you just give it up you'll never get pyra she's more than just the aegis or some kind of weapon. She's a living being. Pyra has somewhere she needs to go. And I'm gonna help her. I'm not gonna let you stand in her way. Tiresome. The power of the Aegis is formidable, but the driver's skill betrays her. Stay vigilant, Morag. An unknown power lurks within this bow. But of course, this blade he calls Pyra. Your flames burn far stronger than hers. But. Her flames hide something deeper. Is everyone all right? Hanging in there. Those two, very strong. I know. At this rate, we'll never. There has to be a way. Some kind of. She's a fireplace. We've got to find. Water. There! Guys, are you ready to run? Hmm? Sure. Then follow me. Ah, there they are. Pyra, can you manage a full powered blast? Yes! Maybe one or two. That'll do. Talking. Puppy, no! Roger, Roger! <sighs> the water time. So that's their plan.
It's pretty epic. I feel slighted. How so? They actually held back against me in battle. You think that boy... Did you not see? He could have struck me with that blow. But he averted his aim. He did have good instincts, too. And I'm gonna help her. I'm not gonna let you stand in her way. The Aegis. If she is traveling with that boy, perhaps it is worth letting them roam free for a while. You mean... We'll cross paths again. And when we do, we shall see. Pretty epic. What'd you guys think of that? That's exciting, man. It really is. <laughs> it's it's very it's kind of comic-y too. I don't think they're following us. Perhaps we're safe for now. You're right. We should get some rest. I can't go any further. Ah, oh, Tora is pooped as well. <sighs> oh, Finn. See you later. Huh? We are grateful for all you've done. We wish you well on your travels. Farewell. I want to reach Elysium. What? I made a promise. I'm taking Pyra to Elysium. It's just... She gave half of her life to save mine. I owe her. Oh, Rex. But half the world seems to be after her. With the Titans dying off, living spaces running out, that's gonna start wars. And people need weapons to fight wars. That's why they want her. <sighs> if I can prove Elysium exists, maybe I can stop the war that's coming. But... Fighting Morag taught me something. I'm not strong enough. I can't do this alone. Nia, you're a driver. We could really use a companion like you. <laughs> if you wanted. Elysium. Do you really believe in that myth, kid? Well... Pyra told me that she was born there. Yet here she is. So it must exist. Right? <laughs> your logic is almost as good as Dougal's. Listen, Rex. I don't know if you're stupid or just too nice for your own good. But what if Pyra's just lying? What if this is all an act, and one day she turns round and stabs you in the back? Pyra wouldn't do that. Of course I wouldn't. I don't have a knife. So... serious. She... <laughs> An emerald core crystal is the sign of the Aegis, huh? Sure, why not? This could be interesting. Really? My lady? I kind of want to see this Elysium for myself now. Maybe it really does exist. It does. An endless field of green among the clouds, eh? If the legends are true, even people like me... <laughs> Toro is just like right in front of him. He's like, get the heck out of here. I'm in the middle of a conversation, kid. Why'd they program that? That's funny. I'm sorry. Did I wrap it too tightly? It's fine. I'm fine. See? I can swing it like this and it doesn't even... I knew it. Thanks. I feel much better now. 
I'm sure that's me as poultice doing its job. Thanks. Pyro, you hurt too. Are you okay? I'm fine. It's just a scratch. Hey, let me help. Thank you, Rex. No worries. Least I can do. There, all done. How's that? Hmm. Looks good. Um, Rex? Look, they're the same. Oh. Uh, yeah? I guess they are. <laughs> So beautiful. Yeah. It really is. I guess that's probably because you made it, Pyra. Huh? Um, no. What? I didn't mean it like that. You're just um really good at making fires. That's all. It's what I do. It's like a movie. It's like we're watching a movie. So that's it. That's the end of chapter two. All right, that's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll, I'll we'll save right here. Oh, that's great. Okay, you know what? That's a great stopping point. <laughs> Like, as much as I love watching the movies and the cutscenes of the game, I love the battle and the affinity chart and all the skill trees and stuff like that. The game's really cool so far, so thank you guys so much for watching. We'll continue on with even more Xenoblade Chronicles 2 with your help and support, so do me a favor, smash the like button and share the video with a friend if you guys would like to see some more. You guys can watch our entire playlist by clicking on screen over here, check out the newest video on my channel there, some recommendations, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you're updated on the latest and greatest Nintendo Switch content. We'll see you on the next episode of Xenoblade Chronicles 2. Take care.